I visited my local shelter's website and the first puppy that I had noticed had two words next to it, special needs, and it so happens he was born deaf. And at the time, my nephew was nine years old. He was also born deaf, so I knew this was a puppy that I absolutely had to meet. I'm leaving the room for meeting him and so excited about adopting this new deaf puppy in my life. A man asked me why I would want to adopt a broken dog. And it just set forth this fire underneath me. So once he got his therapy certification, I approached my administration and I said, how would you guys like to have Cole visit maybe like one day a week? He can hang out with me in the music room since I see all the students. And he came, he visited the first day of school and the first day of school is a very emotional time for children. That year there was no crying children as they came off the bus for the first day of school. That one day a week turned into the last five years, five days a week, and Cole has not missed a day of school. But what it's doing is it's putting students' barriers and walls down. They're learning through Cole's life story about not judging something by its cover. He's enlightening students to really just put themselves out there and be who they are and enjoy who they are. I'm speaking for the thousands upon thousands of children we've been blessed enough to work with, not just in school every day, but in the school programs, the special needs, the special Olympics students that we go and we meet with, our veterans, our hospice patients, the inspiration they are finding behind his story, showing people that you can believe in heroes. Heroes really do exist. This little deaf shelter dog that that man called Broken on my way out literally changed my life path. He changed the way that I have an outlook on life. I get to wake up next to this, this face every single day. It's literally a dream come true.